Hey, how are you doing? Yo, behind the tree. Yeah, I don't know if anyone's asked you that out of all of today. Maybe, uh, maybe no one has. So, uh, I'm going to ask you. I hope you've been all right. And I hope you've had a productive day. But maybe, maybe you haven't had a productive day. You've been inside all day, but you want to make a change. You want to do anything. And maybe it is just because you want to be that slightly bit more attractive to the other sex, to that girl of your dreams, to that crush, to whoever that crush is. You just want to be slightly more attractive. You want to actually be able to go up to talk to her and not look like some sort of creep. And I can show you how you can do this by changing one simple, one little simple skill, but a skill that has been so diminished that no one uses anymore. And that could literally make a difference like day and night. And that is to be more relaxed. My name is Wada and I help other young men like me take back control of their lives. But how? How can a relaxed version of you be able to pull more girls than the current version of you? You see, this skill is so diminished. No one, no one is relaxed nowadays. If you're somewhere around my age, maybe a bit younger, so you're in your teens, you're getting up to your 20s, like me, you'll find that you're in college, you're doing A-levels, you're trying to choose your new university to go to, or whether to go into that work life, nine to five job life. You're stressed. You are stressed. A-levels is not relaxing. Choosing a new uni to go to is not relaxing. Peer pressure to choose different subjects and to do well in those subjects. The teen life is stressful. <laughs> it is, it is stressful. Most people your age, you're stressed most of the time, not relaxed. And even in adulthood, adults, who are in their nine to five jobs, 80% of adults say that they are stressed whilst on the job. No one is relaxed nowadays because there are so many things to be worried to be stressed about. So it's hard not to. But then how can a relaxed version of you be able to pull more girls? See, what I want you to do is to imagine two versions of yourself. One relaxed version and one tense version. Now imagine the tense version of you cold approaching. Cold approaching is when you basically approach a girl, that it's a random stranger in a coffee shop and you just go talk to her. That's cold approaching. Imagine a tense version of you going up to this to this random crush in the coffee, coffee shop. Say, say it's your crush, right? Someone you find attractive or maybe it's someone you want to talk to in school. Imagine the tense version of you walking up to her where you're not used to this. You're not used to cold approaching girls. It's it's an unusual feeling. So you're uncomfortable. You're stressed. Your shoulders are quite tight. You're walking quite tight. You look like you're worried that you're overthinking. You look uncomfortable. And then you've got the relaxed version of you who walks up, but he's doesn't look uncomfortable. He looks like he he's comfortable. He looks like he's in his natural element. He looks like that he's not overthinking, that he's not worried. He looks very comfy, very relaxed. Which do you think is more attractive? The guy who's relaxed and got his shoulders back, his body language is quite relaxed, or the guy who's really, really tense and really tight. See, this is what girls mean when they say that they like a guy with confidence. A relaxed guy gives off this confidence feeling. But how? How can you do this? That's the big question. And it's the same technique that is used as one of the main, the main, like, focus points for self-improvement and also meditating and that is I want you to focus on your breathing more importantly stomach breathing now when you're breathing and meditating you're told to focus on your breath but you're more importantly told to focus breathing in for your nose okay not mouth breathing not this <laughs> the nose breathing you're told to breathe through your nose and not just through your chest but to your stomach so where when you breathe through your nose your chest doesn't rise your stomach bulges out now the way that this makes you more relaxed is when you are breathing through your stomach this is known as a deep breath rather than a shallow breath when you're giving in breathing in very deep breaths your whole body becomes relaxed because you're breathing in bulging out your stomach you're not worried about sucking in your stomach to make it look like your abs. You have abs, uh, because you're just breathing in, bulging out your stomach, and you're fully relaxed. Your shoulders relax. Your body becomes relaxed. You give off this sort of confidence feeling. And the way you know that you're doing this right, literally do this here with me. The way you can tell that you're doing this right is when you breathe in through your nose, your shoulders don't rise, and you're pushing it out in your stomach instead. 
So when you breathe with your stomach, your shoulders won't rise. However, when you breathe with your chest, your shoulders, your shoulders then move up. This is something that takes like a five minute change. But the thing is, because no one does it, it's so difficult to, you have to manually think to breathe. You always have to tell yourself, okay, breathe with your stomach. You basically always have to keep on top of it. Even me, who's been on self-improvement for nearly two years now, I forget to breathe with my nose sometimes. I forget to breathe with my stomach sometimes. You just gotta keep on top of it. You'll be way more relaxed and you'll be way more comfortable and then the conversation will flow way more naturally. My God, it was so cold. It is so cold right now. It's like minus degrees and it's like frost across everything. Uh, but it looks so pretty because like the tree that I'm sat under has got like ice droplets on the branches and it looks so cool. I wanna take one home. You know what, I fucking will. If you like this video and this video actually helped you out, click on the one in the corner because this will most likely definitely change your life as well. And it will help you. Stay consistent and do the best you can. Love you, bro. Oh, getting up. I feel so fucking old. Self-improvement kiss. Mwah.